I've been like you were saying. I've been I've had amazing experience uh, to the lead up um, of it. Um, you know, the Olympics is one. You know, being by the side of Fraser and you know who's been there and done that. You know, entered the world, entered the Europeans, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. So, you know, having him as well there, sort of learning from him, um, has been very, very uh, valuable yeah. to me. And it, and it's you know it's not just been the Olympics. It's been entering um you know competing for GB initially in, in in Lithuania and sort of just the training and you know the GB life that I've been having for the past uh coming out coming out to I think a year and a half now so it's all sort of um led very nicely to to um the next couple of weeks now to lead up uh, for the world tell us how the the worlds came about in terms of from your own qualification and when you knew that you were going to get the nod for it uh so I got it I got the um, sort of the notification, a letter uh, last week, and it's just on a selection basis. So, mm -hmm. if the uh, you know the heads of GB believe that you are you know you can medal and you're good enough, then they will enter you for it at that weight class. So, um, you know I'm, I'm fortunate enough, and I'm glad I've been given the opportunity. Uh, I'm very grateful to know that the coaches at GB know that I am I'm sort of uh, I'm ready for it and I can uh, medal. So. Um, all to do now is to just sort of uh, to go on there and do it. But no, my the camp's been going great um, for the lead up, and you know, GB know GB boxing know exactly what you know what they're doing. They've had you know many many years experience, mm -hmm. so I know I'm in the best hands um, mm -hmm. to the lead up of this competition. Do you know what? I'm 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 new to this you know international scene, so I'm not really. Like I don't really know or aware of you know too much of the opponents there or anything like that. I know there'll be a lot more opponent sort of uh, focus as I get closer to the competition um, mm. for sort of like the fight strategy uh, aspect of it. But in terms of sort of uh, you know who the opponents are or anything like that, it doesn't doesn't bother me too much. It doesn't bother me at all really. I just sort of I know that there'll be good competition. It'll be a good level of competition. Um, so I, that's what I'm getting, you know, ready for mentally and physically. Um, but, you know, the aspect of knowing who the opponents are, I'm not too sure just yet until I start getting the sort of fight analysis of them when I'm competing. That's the thing. That's the thing, the amateurs. Like, you know, we're going to be fighting different fighters on different days. Um, you know, it's only three rounds. So it's like there's not much you can... Yes, there's stuff you can sort of learn from them and take on, but you can't watch them too long and too much because then, you know, stuff like that maybe starts getting into your head or they might change their strategy or anything like that. What you can do is just be the best you can be. Uh, and then obviously when the time comes when you are competing against that one opponent, yes, you sort of analyse the, the way they fight and stuff, but that comes, I'd say, a week or two before, you know. So I'm not too sort of... Uh, bothered by the opponent, I know the level will be high. That's 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 as far as I am aware, and I'm and I'm you know preparing and getting ready for that. So that's the whole aim of it, really. You know, to raise my profile and to let people. Well, really, the main aim is to gain the experience. That's the main. But what comes with it was a very good bonus is to raise my profile and let people you know the both the other you know the opponents, the boxers, and sort of the world know that I'm here. I'm working hard, and this is what I want. Um, and I'll be here for a good few years um, as an amateur until the Olympics. So, you know, it's good. This is like a sort of good uh, first entrance into the real proper international world stage. Yeah, yeah, the coaches have been telling me, yeah, that, yeah, uh, you know, I'm on track. And that's simply because I turn up, you know, I'm here, I'm on camp every week, you know, I'm doing all the sparring, all the running, all the s &C that I need to do. Um, I'm putting in extra work. So, I, you know, I know that I'm on track I myself. I can feel that I'm on track. Obviously, most importantly, I'm getting the feedback from the coaches and, you know, they're saying that I'm on track and I'm well on my way to achieve all of these things that, I'm, you know, that I've set out and I plan to to uh, accomplish. Uh, yeah, yeah like, yeah, like you mentioned, uh, South by, I've been going down there. I've been trying to go down every week. Um, so after the camp here, when I'm done in Sheffield, I'll drive down to um, Hereford uh, to support the kids. Uh, you know, I won't call myself a coach, but, you know, I do go there and, you know, if they need any advice, you know, from the boxing, um, not just the actual, you know, not, not just the technical side of things, but, you know, how to sort of cope with pressure before competitions or what to, you know, their diet, you know, how to train outside of the boxing gym, stuff like that, you know, and I feel like 
well, the coaches there say that I'm, I'm, a, I'm sort of like a, a positive sort of um, uh, a role model to them. And, you know, that's that's the aim really there. That's what I'm trying to achieve whenever I go down there and, and I'd work with them. So that's what I've been doing every week. Um, now that I've, I've got about three and a half weeks before I fly out to Serbia for this world, I'm sort of having to focus more on, on competition, mm. getting, you know, as much rest and sleep and recovery as possible after the training sessions. Um, so, but I know after that, I'll be back uh, supporting Maverick Stars and, you know, getting that, the ball, that ball rolling. <laughs>